This is a simple model of a seismometer where I've got a magnet inside a cup on a string attached to a spring on a clamp stand that's got a heavy base and then I've got a coil attached to the bottom of the clamp stand. The coil is connected to an oscilloscope and if you shake the table then the magnet moves which means the magnetic field around the coil is changing and you get an induced potential difference across the coil which is measured on the oscilloscope. And as you can see, if the table is shaken more vigorously, then you get a larger induced potential difference, which is measured on the oscilloscope. Make sure that you have the laptop on a separate table so that you don't shake it and damage it. This wouldn't be much good as a real seismometer because it's not damped enough, as it's, you can see it's continuing to swing even after I've stopped shaking the table. It's easy to set this up. All you need to do is have a piece of string attached to a spring that you might use for hook's law, and then the other end of the string is attached through a plastic cup. You've put your neodymium magnet inside that over a 120 turn coil, which is then connected into this USB oscilloscope, which is connected to the computer. You could also use a real oscilloscope. And this really is an excellent demonstration to show students so that they're prepared when similar sorts of devices come up in the exam and they've got to discuss how as the magnet moves the magnetic field around the coil changes and therefore get an induced potential difference across the coil.